Alright, so let's just do this video inside because it's a thousand degrees outside here in Alabama, man. It is. I tried to do it outside. I was going to do it in front of the pool. I would have to be in the pool, but then if I drop any of my shit, then I'm screwed. So inside we go in front of the wall of guitars. Do you guys make some money today? I don't understand why um, some of you bears or some of you uh, scooters or you fucktards were like, Dude, Redbox ain't ripping. Why are you freaking? You're turning into finance news, dude. Settle down. Um, let's see. Why did I say that? Hmm. Maybe because, um, hey, even John Wick. Way to go, John Wick. We didn't even communicate on this, but him and I both hopped on right at the 920. I think he caught the 925. I caught the 920. 920 on Redbox. I sold, though. At 11.20, and I posted my position on YouTube community. I believe he's still holding. He did not sell his position. Um, I left 500 in to hold the wall. I only sold 2,000 like I, guys, like I told you I was going to do. I am now going to start keeping some in to help everybody out. And I'm not going to move them. So now this next play, if I make an extra 100 free shares off of it, I'm going to leave those 100 in. That will bring me up to 600. If I make another 100 free shares, that'll bring me up to 700. I'm going to keep day trading the hell out of Redbox, pulling out my profit, pulling out my investment, leaving my profit. Okay, so I'm helping. I'm helping. Uh, let me say this. I'm a finance channel, so I will always be transparent and show my positions, whether they're in or out, how much I made. And it's all to teach you guys because right now you know I'm out of the play, right? So now you guys are going to be like, okay, if she tanks, if she sells off, which is a really good chance it's going to sell off, then you guys can guess on when I'm getting back in. And then I do a video and I tell you, I got back in and you're like, okay, now I understand what he's doing. I'm learning what this guy is doing. Now I even know when he's going to sell. Um, that's the point of a finance channel, Scooter. All right. You bears. It was all bears today. Bears got pushed out, man. So they all got to come around and, you know, push their tampons in your fucking face because you're losing money. You're not getting your fucking way. There's a tampon shortage. Dollar General. Anyway, let's say this. The reason you have to follow Redbox is because Redbox will squeeze before AMC, but it will trigger the AMC squeeze. Bet your ass it will trigger the GME squeeze as well. What's going on with Redbox is the pressure in which everything is elevated, all right? So there's, there's more strain, cost to borrow. We just found out the float really is $3 million and some change, but out of all the squeeze plays, realize that Redbox has the absolute shortest float with the most amount of pressure applied to it, okay? So learn from this, pay attention to it, invest in it, if we had all 4 million apes come over and buy just one share, it will actually, that would trigger the squeeze because we would have 4 million more shares that don't even exist. Apply that pressure to the hedge funds, it squeezes because the cost to borrow would then quadruple. Think about it. You buy 4 million more f shares, I mean, you're way oversold the float. I don't know how they would do it, but you would way oversell the float, meaning you're applying more pressure the cost to borrow goes through the roof as if it's not already through the roof. They are paying out their asses. So there it is. Yes, absolutely. Redbox will trigger the uh, AMC squeeze and the GME squeeze. Watch uh, your charts today. I want you to pay attention to the spike on all three. They were all timed identical. And that just goes to show you, man. It's just computers doing all this shit. Computers. Putting the money in, pulling the money out. Putting the money on this one, pulling the money... They're all moving in the same direction. It just so happens that Redbox actually moved a little more violently today. So for some reason, there was more attention paid to Redbox. And I believe it is because of the strain they are under, the amount of money they're having to pay, which far exceeds GME and it far exceeds AMC. Uh, and that's it, guys. So now I'm out. I left the 500 in. I'm waiting to get back in. Now, guys, you know if I made a mistake because if she blows up, you guys are going to be like, well, the majority of my stock is out. Teddy fucked up. I mean, she rips into $14, $15, and $16. You know I fucked up because I'm being transparent. So, again, for any of you fucktards getting on to me for being transparent, go to, like, Lou's fucking channel where he's ultimately not. He's got walls up. He won't show you fucking shit. I am Mr. Transparent, and I will always be. That's why I have my own YouTube channel. If you don't like my YouTube channel, 
fuck off and go to somebody else's because I'm not the one asking you to fucking click play. Nobody is but you. All right. So I'm going to do the same shit over and over. And if you keep showing up, you're the fucking idiot. All right. Love you guys, though, for all my subs that have been here since day one. Fucking love you guys. And I hope you pulled profit today. And if you did, congratulations, because that's what it's all about. At the end of your life. Listen, guys, life is fucking tough and it only got tougher for every one of us. Did any of us see this coming? I'm still down $71,000, by the way. My life investment went in majority of it on Tesla. I'm still down $71,000 of my hard earned cash. This wasn't capital gains that I had earned and lost. I had lost all my capital gains on Tesla. Now I'm down $71,000 still trying to recoup my actual investment. You see what I'm saying? Fucking yesterday we were rich. Well, all that capital gains were all excited, man. Let's play this new crypto. Shiba Inu, fucking give me 10 grand of that shit, right? Now look at us. Fuck! You don't even want to open your fucking platform in the morning because you're just like, fuck! Right? Here today, gone tomorrow, man. Take profit and congrats if you did. It'll all rebound, though. It'll all come back. So get you some Shiba Inu, get you some Dogecoin, because this shit's all coming back. Especially, give us two more years, there's your catalyst. And you know what I'm talking about. All right, guys. Time to go hit the pool, baby! Alabama style, 100 degrees, and we're going to tan it up! Y'all have an awesome night. Doge Warrior out. Shaboom!